there's a race that everybody knows between the two world super powers. In the years between 1957 and 1975, the two countries competed for supremacy in space exploration. With the recent budget cuts in NASA and the retirement of its prominent space shuttles, NASA has to send its space crew to other countries for space travel. American crews have to pay for room to board on Chinese and Russian space, space rockets to reach space. This takes America from being a top dog on this space exploration. The three legendary space shuttles. Um, as you can see here, this is Discovery and Atlantis and Indoor World. And instead of being running, uh, taking astronauts to space, they've been put into museums, ending a 30 year space shuttle program. The end of this space shuttle program brings about the layoff of more than 8,000 8, 8, engineers, technicians, and other employees. High number of job, jobless and cash flow to other parts of the economy and privatization is also the cause for shutdown of NASA. This results into Children will no longer be fascinated with the field of space science and the possibility of setting foot on the moon because NASA has lost many of its inspiration. As you can see here, this is astronaut Dale Darden uh, holding up a sign for, um, which says for sale. So uh, children uh, all over the world or in America might be no longer the dream of being an astronaut one day or um, any uh, in space science because NASA, if if we if we not if we don't keep NASA running and if it is NASA is being um, if NASA is being privatized, then It's, it might it might uh, endanger its existence. So yeah, thank you.